I'm a Palawan. And then they will be like, well, what is that? I'm like, well, it's an island in the South Pacific. The island is actually like south. Like on a map, literally, it's a dot. And there are 16 islands that makes up Palau, and, and there's a main island that's Koror, and that's where like the airport is at. In the U.S., as many people as we are, we're very aware of our um, origin, and I think that makes us understand each other more, and so the fact that we have our own month is beautiful to me, because I mean, people in the U.S. are not like, it's like a huge melting pot. Everybody knows Palawan because that's like the main language. I mean, before you go to a store, like especially if you're on the small islands, you'll call the neighbor and say, hey, is so-and-so open today? And they'll look out there and they'll be like, eh, no, I don't see light. So then you don't go to the store, you have to wait. But I think it's just because, I mean, it's, they're, they're not in any hurry to go anywhere. People in the military would go nuts because they have like no concept of time. Like everything we do is on a time schedule and a timetable. They could care less. We have like parties where we cook our own food and just be with each other. And we sing our Palawan music and we dance our Palawan dances and we say come and that's like welcome. Like you go through the airport and they're like come. They're like, what are they saying? <laughs> and they're, we're saying, welcome. And the military people really take you in and you know, you become this one team and you're like, you know, we are, you take care of each other. And that's kind of why I think I like the military is because I find that missing piece that I don't have.